This is a, uh, a torchlight lantern. You have to preheat the generator. So that the fuel going in will vaporize. This is a very early style of a vapor pressure lantern. I'm really not sure how much preheating this is going to take, so... There we go. Now we've been trying to figure out exactly what type of burner head this is. General thought seems to be, oh look at that, what's going on here? That it might be some sort of nautical unit, uh, like off of a buoy or the end of a, uh, a pier, a warning light. It's too small for a uh, lighthouse, but um, the burner setup on this is very similar to one of the early uh, Kitson burners, so I don't know, it might be a Kitson, might not be, but the, the mechanics of it are the same, that was the very, very first of the uh, vapor, they call them incandescent oil vapor lamps. I'm going to turn the lights out. See just how bright this rascal is. I'm using two different types of mantles in here. The one on the right is from American Mantle. It's called a soft mantle. The one on the left is an Aladdin mantle. And they both seem to work pretty good. Um, I have the tank pressurized to about uh, 12 PSI right now. So that's it. That's my uh, Jules Verne Mystery Lantern burning in all of its glory. It's been a fun project. I really had some ups and downs on this, but uh, we're in the home stretch. So thanks a lot for looking. Keep the light burning. And remember, always do your first fires outside. This is the second, third fire on this, so I know it's not going to blow up. All right, thanks for looking. Bye.